welcome back to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet please go ahead and subscribe so you won't miss out of any of my coming tutorial uh, today we'll be uh, working on this off, sh off shoulder top it's very easy to make I used the pattern and I have a link for it in the description below so let's get started So the pattern, uh, I think it's uh, kind of uh, discontinued, but uh, <laughs> thankfully I found the link and uh, in the description. I'm going to do, be doing view number one, like I'm pointing at. Uh, you can have long sleeves, you can have uh, uh, all this for uh, views that you have there. And these are all the pieces that you would need to cut. And also inside the pattern instructions, you can see there is a, a part for your elastic size. Because these are the main thing that I like to focus on because sometimes I will miss it. Or I forget it because I know how to assemble the, the top. So anyhow so i just said to show you uh these uh also i'll be doing another tutorial on how to use a uh, pattern so and also uh, my fabric and my elastic and my scissor so i went ahead and i cut all my pieces so like i'm showing you there is a piece for the back and there's a piece for the front like you see this is our front piece And this is will be our back piece as you see the curve for the neck is uh, less or um, less of the curve for your neck and this is like uh, uh, the off shoulder bar and it's just like a circle and it, you cut it on fold and you sew it from the edges we will do this once we go ahead and start sewing and these parts are for the underarms um, uh, finish. So first thing we do is I'm going to add a stay stitch. A stay stitch will allow your fabric not to stretch while you are working on the rest of the garment. So I'm going to go ahead and add my stay stitch on the shoulders uh, and on the neck holes for both the front and the back pieces. All of these instructions will be found on the pattern. Um, I bought this pattern long time ago from a local fabric store. So I'm glad we have it online as well. So you can go ahead and purchase it if you like. It's very easy pattern and it's very easy to make. Once we finish uh, the stay stitch, we are going to put the two pieces together, front one, the front and the back. So you put them uh, right side facing each other and uh, make sure you match your notches in your pattern. Uh, uh, while you're cutting your fabric, there will be some notches that you have to mark. So make sure you uh, transfer this into your fabric as well. So match your notches and uh, pin or clip from the side and we are going to sew. These are the side notches like I'm showing you. So match it together and pin or clip.
I also went ahead and I searched my uh, side seams. So now we are going to work on the underarms uh, part. So the two parts that I show you earlier, we are going to um, uh, put them for the underarm. So you turn your uh, uh, your uh, plows uh, inside out and then uh, um, match the right sides together and uh, we are going to bend or clip around the shoulder opening and again uh, make sure you match your notches like i'm showing you So once you finish sewing, it should look like that. I also went ahead and I iron it. I fold it like I'm showing you and iron it. So I'm just to show you the edges only the bar that is showing. You folding all the whole, all the underarm piece to fold and uh, uh, and then iron it. And then now we are going to uh, pin it in place. And we're gonna sew in the very uh, edge of the fold piece that we uh, created for the underarm so i uh, finished sewing the underarm part and i also went ahead and i got i gave it a good press now we are going to work on this uh, <laughs> Uh, circle bees uh, so basically you are going to clip it from the side or pin it and sew the edge together so once you do the and I, I do this you can search the edge as well which I did and now we are going to fold our edges for this uh, off shoulder piece um, it's better off if you go ahead and iron it and um, I just went ahead and I was I wanted to show you so I just uh, clip a, a fold a one centimeter and another centimeter and uh, clip or pin all around so after you do this of course you're gonna go ahead and sew it so I finished sewing now we are going to find the center of our front uh, piece of our top and match it with the center of our piece of the off shoulder piece also I'm matching the 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 seam of uh, the end of my off shoulder piece with the center of my back of my top and then pin it or clip it in place
So now uh, we are going to add our elastic. Basically, you're going to fold the edge like I'm showing you, one centimeter and another centimeter. Or if you can go ahead an inch, uh, it's all up to your preferences. And then tuck your elastic inside. So this, uh, we came to the end. We completed our project. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you create one uh, like desktop, please send me some picture. I have an Instagram and Facebook in the description below. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe, a like, and share. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.